The U.S. dollar exchange rates stabilized this Monday morning in the markets of the capital, Baghdad, and in Erbil, in the Kurdistan region. The dollar price witnessed stability with the opening of the al Kifa and al Harithiya stock exchanges in Baghdad, where it recorded 149,200 dinars for every $100, which is the same price it recorded yesterday, Sunday. The selling prices in exchange shops in the local markets in Baghdad also stabilized, as the selling price reached 150,250 dinars, while the buying price reached 148,250 dinars for every $100. In Erbil, the dollar also recorded stability in exchange shops, where the selling price reached 149,150 dinars against the dollar and the buying price reached 149,050 dinars for $100. Oil prices continued their losses in early trading on Monday, as investors assessed the increase in OPEC and production from next October, against a sharp decline in Libyan production amid weak demand in China and the United States, the world's largest oil consumers. Brent crude futures were down 57 cents, or 0.7%, at 76.36 a barrel by 108 GMT. West Texas Intermediate WTI crude futures were down 50 cents, or 0.7%, at 73.05 a barrel. The losses come after a 0.3% decline in Brent crude last week and a 1.7% decline in West Texas Intermediate crude. Six sources from the Organization of the Petroleum Exporting Countries OPEC and its allies, or the group known as OPEC Plus, told Reuters that the group was close to moving forward with a planned increase in oil production from October. Eight OPEC and members are set to increase their output by 180,000 barrels per day in October, as part of a plan to start easing the latest tranche of 2.2 million barrels per day of production cuts with further cuts to continue until the end of 2025. In Libya, the Arabian Gulf oil company has resumed production of up to 120,000 barrels per day to meet domestic needs, while exports remain halted, engineers said Sunday, after a dispute between armed factions shut down most of the country's oil fields. Both Brent and WTI crude have suffered losses for two straight months as economic concerns in China and the United States outweighed disruptions to Libyan supplies and rising geopolitical tensions in the Middle East. Data from the U.S. Energy Information Administration showed on Friday that, U.S. oil consumption slowed in June to its lowest seasonal levels since the COVID-19 pandemic in 2020.